The nominees for Interactive are... Interactive. CBBC Hacker and Dodge Pop Stars. Moshi Monsters. With the ever-expanding world of Monstro City at their fingertips, every day is a monstrous adventure. Just like real pets, monsters need looking after. Earn enough rocks by solving puzzles and playing mini-games, and they can give their new pet a makeover, customize its house, and collect lots of monsterific items. Tate Movie Project. That's right, a finished feature film made entirely by kids. In July 2010, we launched the interactive site with a film studio where kids could take part in all aspects of filmmaking, inspiring over 400,000 visits to the site and over 40,000 contributions from kids uploading their own art and ideas. The land of me. Together you'll make monsters. Alter environments. Construct buildings. Choreograph dances. Compose music, tell stories, and more. And the BAFTA is awarded to Tate Movie Project <laughs> 2. Um, this project has been the most amazing collaboration between some great British brand, ba brands. Tate, Ardman, the BBC and Fallon have all been involved and there's such talented people that um, I can't thank enough and we can't possibly name them all and still be here uh, to, with, for more than an hour or two. But um, uh, thank you to our sponsors, Legacy Trust UK and BP. But above all, I think this project is really about children's vision and imagination. There's been so much energy, so many ideas that those children contributed. So thank you to the children, all 34,000 of you. Thanks very much. I'm here with the guys behind Tate Movie Project, which has just won the Children's BAFTA for Interactive. Guys, how are you feeling? Fantastic. Slightly yeah, shaky. Yeah. Yeah, good. <laughs> now, how did the idea come about? It came about when uh, we asked the creative agency Fallon, who worked with Tate, to think of a project that could engage children with art. We wanted children to get excited about their own creativity, and they came up with this amazing idea using Ardman's talents and brilliance to bring those ideas to life, so the kids' ideas. And what do you think is the biggest success of the Tate Movie Project? I think it's about the sheer involvement of the kids, how every child that had the opportunity to get involved just jumped on board and did art, did music, did voices, did stories, yeah. and that is the biggest single success. I mean, it involves over 25,000 kids. How did you fit them all in the office? <laughs> Not all at once. <laughs> Dad worked out a plan. So well, we had this kind of uh, uh, virtual studio where they all came along and uh, joined in and they, they, was, they were basically so constantly productive on this space they just made and made and made stuff all throughout so couldn't stop them, couldn't stop them. now i hear a movie uh, ca came out of the project yeah. tell us a bit about that it's about um 11 year old beanie the story really came out of um, a kid's imaginations a joint kids imaginations 11 year old beanie who goes off to save his parents and to send the golden knit back to the, his rightful heart place at the heart of the sun and um, only for just, the minds of children. Yeah, it's only surreal, but brilliant actually, yeah. and really compelling. It sounds really good. good. Yeah, it's, it's good fun. Awesome. So, uh, what's in the pipeline for the future? Any more big, uh, big projects with like fifty thousand kids, maybe half a million kids? <laughs> yeah, like, we're working nice. on it. We've got a plan. <laughs> the kids, their website's still live actually, and the kids are making their own movies on it now. Yeah. So yeah. check it out: www.takemovie.co.uk. That's the one. So it's always growing. Yeah. Well done, guys. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Really exciting. Thank you.